Uh, speaking of questions, actually, this one's for the audience. Does anybody out there have Verizon's Fios? I'm going to tell you why in a second. HBOGo.com, HBO's new online streaming service, a.k.a. Well, HBO taking aim at Netflix and Amazon and Vudu and Hulu, is out of beta. So it's up, well, it's kind of out of beta if you subscribe to Comcast or Verizon Fios. Comcast, when you basically, you go to like, you know, HBOGo.com, it's like, okay, who's your provider? You go to Comcast, it just redirects you to Fancast.com. So the HBO content may be in there, you just can't tell what it is. Um, it's no specific HBO section. I'm going to keep looking for it, though. And DirecTV, Dish, and every other cable network says HBO Go is not currently available from your television provider, which is a, sucks, but, you know, DirecTV is smaller than Comcast, so Comcast, who doesn't give it to you, gets it first, which makes no sense, but basically means if there's somebody out there with Verizon Fios that's running HBOGo.com, do us a favor, email us at uh, hcnation at revision3.com and let us know what you think of it, because None of us actually have Verizon Fios out here. Nope. And we're waiting patiently for HBO Go to show up on DirecTV or, or any other kind of network. Unless somebody actually knows where it is inside of the, the, the Comcast website. Which I guess, what's Comcast called now? Uh, Xfinity. Xfinity. I guess they're, they're promoting that as they move toward their 100 megabit service eventually. But uh, I like the idea of a 100 megabit service. I owe oh, how much? <laughs> <laughs>